The only blues in my collection that was the closest I could get to was this one from Sephora, which is called My Favourite Jeans. This is the one I'm going to be using because it has a metallicness to it, which is what Kim Kardashian was wearing. I don't know if they still do it, I don't know, because I bought that when I was in Paris. We don't have Sephora in the UK, unfortunately. And the other one, which you can get in the UK, is this shade right here. It's called In The Buff. The only problem with this is it is a matte shade and obviously Kim Kardashian had a metallic blue. I'm going to be using this brush today for the eyeshadow. It is by Morphe. It's the M135. Now Kim, Kim's eye, well that is, wow, that's nice. <laughs> Kim's eye was very sharp, blended very slightly. It wasn't blended much, to be honest. So we're going to make sure that we have quite a sharp line and I'm going to slightly blend it just because I feel like it's more wearable that way but we are going to try and recreate it still so just really create a line and then we're going to fill it in if that makes sense so create a sharp line and then point it out at the end it was very pointed So now I've got the shape, I'm going to, like I've done on this side, bring it up higher in that inner corner and just connect it to that line. Maybelline's Master Drama in black coal liner on the inner waterline. And now I'm going to go with the bottom part of my eye and connect all of it with the same blue shade. You can see how like super easy this is. I'm using the same brush. I might go in with a smaller brush just to get into the inner corner, but other than that, I've used one brush, one eyeshadow. And that is how it looks so far. I look crazy. I've got quite large eyes. I feel like this shape makes my eyes look even bigger, which I don't necessarily need to look bigger, but this shape, and maybe it's the colour of the eyeshadow as well, I don't know, but it's making my eyes look like bug eyes. <laughs> Morphe M507 brush, just blend out the edges slightly with this brush, but I don't want to overdo it, so that's why I'm using this tiny brush, just to go on that line, slightly blend it out, just don't put any colour on the brush because we're not adding colour here, we're just trying to blend it. She didn't really have much of an eyeliner, but she did have sort of a black band going across the eye, so I'm just going to use the same coal liner from Maybelline that I used in my waterline, and I'm just going to do a line going across, but I'm not going to wing it out or anything like that. Once you've done that, you can go in with lashes. The lashes I'm using are by Dull Beauty, as always, they are like my favourite eyelashes at the moment. And this one is called Chloe, and these are my favourite as well. Mascara time, I'm using my L'Oreal Telescopic on the bottom lashes. You can put them on the top lashes as well, but not too much because you don't want to get it on your fake lashes. That is what your eyes should look like so far. I've went and done my foundation, concealer, and all that kind of stuff off camera because we're just focusing on the eyes and lips today but I do have a whole separate video on foundation if you want to see it. This is a new truffle I believe by NYX Lip Liner and this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in stripped. Everything's down in the description box below so check that out. All the products I use as well as the links to them. That is it for this video. I hope you liked it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you haven't already. I love this look. I think it's beautiful. If you want to see more Kim Kardashian looks, let me know and I shall see you in my next video.